interest on loans from the yet-to-be-established Development Bank Ghana will not necessarily come cheap, as according to the Bank of Ghana. Now, Dr. Ennis Addison at a press conference explained, contrary to perceptions, loans will give in market rates. The Development Bank is not coming in to give you free money. The Development Bank is a bank that is being put together, you know, to do things differently from the way that the old development banks have operated, which has landed them in the type of trouble that we see with the NIBs and the other unsuccessful, you know, development banks. The idea is to do it differently. And one of the different ways of going about it is to have a wholesale bank, a wholesale bank that would be on lending to you know, participating financial institutions, which would, I believe would be the commercial banks. Alongside, the Development Bank Ghana will also address two constraints in the country's financial system, being the lack of long-term funding and inadequate funding to productive sectors of the economy. These are resources that will be lent at market conditions. I think for me, the positive thing about the development bank is the fact that we are going to see a larger supply of long-term you know money which is what uh, you know in the domestic market you don't tend to find uh, the SMEs and the banks are borrowing one year two year tenor now you have the possibility of getting money that will be on lent at the medium term five-year, six, seven-year tenor. That alone should make a major impact in terms of extending, you know, the repayment period, you know, for, for the facility and therefore should help some of these SMEs. Currently, less than 15% of loans given out by banks are for five years or longer, making the investment into long-term projects difficult for the private sector.